We will continue our iLogic Vessel tutorial with the development of the skirt component. The objective will be to assemble the skirt for use in the vessel assembly. Create a new assembly using the skirt template and save the file as skirt comp. We will place an iLogic component called the skirt flange We will set the OD to match the OD of the assembly The thickness will be skirt flange thickness The width will be the skirt flange width the bolt hole number will be free and the bolt hole diameter will be free as well so click OK right click and select done and now we are ready to place the skirt part so place another iLogic component, select the skirt part, set the OD to the assembly OD, the thickness to the assembly thickness, the length to the skirt length, and the skirt vessel offset to the skirt vessel offset and click OK. Click on the screen to locate the vessel skirt and right click and select done and save the file. Now that we have the skirt component assembled, let's look at the iLogic rules that were created. Click on Manage, select Rule Browser, and let's look at the skirt flange rule. So double click it. You can see here we have three lines of code, which basically are setting the OD, the thickness, and the width of the skirt flange to the OD thickness and the width values that we have in the assembly. If you wish to add or modify any of this, you can. Um, it's completely editable. Um, this just gets you started and makes sure that the values are consistent. If we look at the rule for the skirt, it's the same thing. You can see here the OD, the length, the thickness, and the vessel shell offset are controlled by the assembly that we're in.